Hey guys, happy new year to you. This is Kobe with Husky's Garage. Thanks for joining in. If this is your first time with us, we appreciate you and we hope that you are entertained for a little while with us. Please um, like and subscribe if you are. I am down in our workshop right now that you've probably never seen. Uh, the leashes above me and to my side are from past pups that we previously lost. Um, and so I know they're in heaven with Jesus right now, but it's just kind of a mento to us. We are a Christian family organization that we like to do stuff good, clean, and fun. So if you are entertained by that, please consider like and subscribing. I want to share a new project with you that we've never had before. It's completely different than anything we've ever messed with. Um, God blessed us the week before Christmas. I was talking to my wife and said, you know what? I think I want to get one of these one day. I didn't think it was going to happen as soon as it did. And like I said, God has tremendously blessed us. We got it yesterday. We did a little things a little bit backwards. I'm going to show you what I'm talking about here in a second. But got it yesterday and going to show you the wash video for it. It's only a couple minutes long. Um, and I'll jump in right now. Gentle on this one, that's the computer.
So you see, we got that washed up. Just uh, it was really dusty. It'd been sitting for. Man told me at least a year, but I'm pretty sure it was longer than that. And we rolled it in here, which I'll show you in a second, and um, started working on it. So I'm gonna split that in now. Hey guys, it's uh, Kobe and Heather with Huskies. So uh, this is our new project. Um, we're kind of skipping out a little bit on this video. We're 
missing a couple pieces. It's been wrecked. So we're going to see a bit of crank for the first time in... 12 what? years? Well, no. I think it's six years, but he told me it cranked last year, so I don't know. Anyway, I got it hooked up to jumper cables because the battery has to charge for like eight days. Y'all know how that is. <laughs> anyway, so we'll see if it'll do anything. We gotta, it, it's not gonna crank with the kickstand. Apparently, they don't crank with the kickstand. I don't know if that's true or not. I know the fuel pump's working. It should crank with being on the thing, because they crank it up all the time. now here we are so we're gonna get back to working on this thing uh, it has been in a wreck which is part of the fun um, just wanted something to learn on never got to ride before always kind of wanted to does scare me a little bit but you know uh, so it is in a little bit of scrambles right now but you know we're gonna we're gonna figure stuff out I don't think it's getting spark or it's not getting fuel so I took the tank kind of off last night and we're gonna test for spark here in a minute so, hope you guys enjoy and bear with me. There she is, guys. We didn't have a battery last night, and I wanted to. We, we went and got one. It's one of those you have to charge for so long, which is over there charging. So, I was just dumping it off. Our old diehard battery we're using basically every project. You see, we took the saddle bog off because he wrecked it, and it looked like he laid it down on this side. Um, and I got the air filter up there. We've been messing with it last night and got tired, went to eat, and went to bed. Uh, so, you know, this is a Yamaha V Star. It's a 2005, I think it's the 1100 Classic, uh, which is 1100A or something like that. And it's a nice, nice bike. It is missing the seat. We do have other parts to the seat, and we forgot to bring them in last night. So, hopefully, nobody took them. I doubt they did. But, Hope y'all enjoy. Okay, everybody. So, um, I know you might be wondering what that's about. I've got that over there so it won't ground out on the chrome or the metal. So, we took the tank off, took the protector off of the carburetors so we can get down to them. I just found the fuse panel, which is up in here. Take those out in a second, make sure ain't nothing below because the horn ain't working, lights ain't working, nothing. Here's the fuel filter. I know the pump's on, you can hear it. Turn the key. You hear it. So the pump's working. And that's what she's doing. So we gotta figure out what's going on. It's either not getting fuel or it's not getting spark. My guess is the uh, hopefully it's getting spark. My guess is the carburetors are gummed up from sitting so long. You can see all the dust that's still on it, dirt. So we'll be back, figure this out, and uh, uh, hope you enjoy everybody. So the uh, headlight in the uh, blinker fuse was broke. So now we got headlights, you can see. We got blinkers. Uh, that one's going to be replaced. He, he smashed it. 
And we got horn. <coughs> so I need to figure out what is going on. Why he's got these lights everywhere. I don't like them. So we're gonna find out what's going on here. I'm just gonna spray some. See what that does. Turn them headlights off. So I guess the headlight stays on the whole time. I don't know. Yeah, I don't think it's even trying to bark. Maybe it is. Who knows? Oh, she she barked off. y'all hear that it's running let me put you on the bipod okay guys so we heard it bark off so we'll crank for the first time in i don't know how many years um please be wise don't try this at home this is quite dangerous i've got a little bottle i've got some gas in that i'm gonna let the pump suck it up i know the pump works so here we go let's try this out So I am extremely blessed. Thank you, Yahweh. That is the Hebrew name for God, by the way. Uh, we are going to be working on this. I ain't got to fool with the spark because obviously he's getting it. Uh, probably just woke my wife up, but she's going to be mad at me anyway for doing that without her. So as you can see, let me turn the camera around here. Hang on. It's going to need a lot of work, um, but we've got apparently a good engine. I'm hoping the transmission works. Got to get a seed ordered. The guy I got it from said that he has one, but if he can't find it, he will order me one. So that's fine. Uh, headlights and blinkers work. Horn works now. It also has it has a, a radio or a Bluetooth. As you can see, there's speakers here. There's a little Bluetooth box. I don't know if I'm going to keep that or not. Uh, it had a windshield. We took it off. We're going to replace this because it's busted. Um, so if you guys like bikes, leave me some comments below and, uh, we're going to get this going and we'll get y'all some more content. Thanks for tuning in. Bye.